I am Katie, and this is Tilly May, and she is a King Charles Cavalier Spaniel. Tilly is one of a kind, and she knows who she needs to cheer up. She knows who's feeling sad, she knows who's hurting, she knows when you need some extra love. My younger sister Stephanie was diagnosed with Ewing sarcoma. She was diagnosed in 2015 of November. Um, and she went through a year of treatment and she rang the bell for end of treatment in January of 2017. And then later that January, she relapsed. She finished this January and then unfortunately she relapsed again later in January. So right now they're um, doing biopsies to try to find the next course of treatment. She went from a triathlete and straight A student to having to you know, miss school and go to doctor's visits and get radiation and chemo and her world just kind of flipped upside down. Her spirits were kind of down. What, what could we do to like preoccupy her and give her something to do because you can only watch so much TV and color so many coloring pages. We looked into uh, getting a dog so my younger sister Josie and I created a PowerPoint presentation and sat our parents down and we're like, listen, Steph really needs this dog. We just have a feeling it's going to be great. Like they're going to bond and it's going to help her out. It's going to make her feel good. It didn't take 10 minutes of convincing, so we got the okay. So we woke um, Steph up from a nap and we were like, okay, I know you're napping, but listen, it's good news, okay? So she woke up immediately and we got up and we did research and found a breed that we liked that was going to be a good lap dog. Um, found a breeder not long after that and uh, made the road trip and she was home all within like a month and a half. She came and she changed everyone's moods. She made sure that everyone was uh, happy and she kept us smiling with her little quirks and sass. She just makes, she makes it easier. She makes it easier to, to go through and have a, have a pal, so. That first week you're kind of, you're in a fog. You don't really know. It takes a while to process. So um, when you have someone like Tilly, who's, you know, a certified in my eyes therapy dog, she, uh, she knows when you're sad and she knows when she needs to come up and just lay in your lap. Like she'll just sit there and just let you pet her. Like she just is. Um, she's very comforting um, when you have those moments where you're kind of breaking down. It's definitely made it a lot easier to have her around. We tried to find the positives and things. I mean, it's been a rough couple of years, but there's a lot of positives that came out of it too. So it's it's brought us closer. It got us tilly. You realize the things that you want done and you want to do together and you kind of puts things into perspective and you focus on those things. So that's kind of how we've chosen to go through it is focus on the good things and do the things that we want to do and not take anything for granted.